Oh, hey guys, it's Rofor, and welcome back to another awesome toy review. Smack the like button, subscribe to that notification bell, turn it on, so you never miss an upload. If you guys watch the video from start to finish, you're part of the awesome squad. Thank you so much, guys. And really, when you subscribe to that notification bell, turn it on, and you smack the like button, you're automatically a part of the awesome squad. Thank you so much for all your support, guys. Today, in today's toy review, I can't wait. I bought the Animal Safari Bucket Adventure Force, or rephrase that I bought the adventure for safari animal bucket with like the smaller one like the 40 pieces but I got the $14 one at Target I don't know at Walmart I apologize at Walmart for like 14 bucks and 55 pieces instead of the regular $10 one which was like 40 pieces if you guys want me to review all my safari animals and all my animal planet stuff and just like you know animals like this and then smack the like button. Let's get like 50 likes on this video. This is the one that I reviewed last time. The smaller version. But oh, I got two. This one and the big one. So let's go check it out, guys. Here we go. All right, guys. Here we are in the kitchen where obviously I do my reviews. Adventure for Safari Animals Jumbo Bucket. 55 pieces, which is like $14. Trust me, with Adventure Force, you get your money's worth with their products. I love them. Adventure Force Safari Animal Bucket. This one is the 40 pieces. This is the regular animal bucket. This is the jumbo bucket because it's bigger. You can tell the size difference. Also, I thought it'd be kind of cool while I was at Target. I picked up some Safari Tubes, Animal Planet Safari Tubes. And I figured, uh, maybe compare them and, uh, you know, have a huge Safari Animal Bucket review. So... Let's go ahead and open up these bad boys. I absolutely loved animal tubes and animal buckets like these while I was a kid when I used to get them from the classic old Toys R Us back in the day. Absolutely loved everything. You always got your money's worth from Toys R Us. They always had some sort of deal going on. Um, and I, I just, I, I miss that store so much. All right, so the plastic comes undone. This pops right off, this little line. Obviously it's a male line because of the mane. So you get little trees, that's pretty cool. So you get little trees that should be able to stand up pretty well. What is this, four, one, two, three? Yes, yeah, so let's see how well, oh, they're a little, little crinkled up, but that's okay. So, but you can definitely put them up against something. Um, no big deal. Let's see, all these animals we got. This is an 18 piece set, so you get 18 pieces. So you get, oh, look at that, and they're all randomized, so you're not going to get the same thing every time. Uh, you get two, or I got two hippos, pretty awesome. Uh, a wildebeest. That's a one big looking deer elk thingy. Uh, let's see here, we also got a rhino. There, I love the rhino, that's so cool. And then you get a little baby elephant. Love the detail on them as well. Another wildebeest thingy. And if I say any of these wrong, don't roast me in the comments. Just correct me politely. <laughs> Sometimes I do get carried away and I don't say the right thing. And I apologize. Oh, this is um, uh, a monkey. Don't know exactly what type of monkey this is, but very cool. Good part to add to my collection. This looks like a hyena. It looks like they were trying to go for a hyena there. And they hunt in packs, so I obviously, hopefully I get more of these. Uh, here is a, uh, I don't want to say cougar or jaguar, uh, maybe a lynx by the tail, I don't know, let me know how much it blows. Very hard to see because of the detail, there's a tiny bit of detail, but I can't tell, you know, point on. Obviously, this is a cheetah because of the spots, you can tell. Here is a gazelle with the, the horns. I used to hunt these in animal hunting games. It was like Big Game Hunter or something like that. I love that game on the PS2. It was phenomenal at PS1. Here are the giraffes. Try to get them out of the plastic here. There we go. We have giraffes. Pretty awesome. They look like they got weird looking spots on them. It looks way faded um, in person than it does on camera, but very cool. Here's a male lion. I love the face scan on the male lion. Very cool. And you got a zebra. So let's go ahead and open up the other animal tube. All right, here's the next little animal planet tube. Now, this is not Adventure Force. This one right here is not Adventure Force. That is, this is not, this is Animal Planet. Just want to make that perfectly clear. So we got some more tree pieces for a display in the background, which will be pretty good. Move these aside so I don't get mixed up. Obviously, I just mixed the trees up, but let's go ahead and dump all these animals out. 
a, another 18 piece tube. So again, you get two hippos. Do we get the same exact thing? I hope not. So you get two hippos. And by the way, they all stand perfectly. They all stand very well. Uh, a gazelle, you get a, another rhino. Did I get the same exact thing? Well, shiz it. Uh, okay, well, that's whatever. I mean, I, now I have two male lions. I have two of everything. So that's pretty awesome. This we, I think it's a lynx or a bobcat. No, bobcats don't have tails. Uh, I, something like that. I'm in the only comment section below. I'm pretty sure everybody down in the comment section will roast me and let me know what animals I'm not saying right. Two giraffes. Another zebra. Or a zebra. And two wildebeest looking thingies. And it looks like another hyena. Another monkey. Uh, an elephant and a cheetah. So pretty cool. Love the little animal planet tubes. That was kind of like extra for this video for all you amazing fans out there. Now let's go ahead and get into the real stuff. The reason why you guys clicked on this video. The safari animals. So let's go ahead with a smaller bucket first. Oh, the plastic was on. I almost pooped myself for a second. The plastic was on it, but I'm like, was this already opened? So, here we are. We have the 40-piece uh, animal, safari animal bucket. So you get some trees, so safari trees or random trees. Oh, by the way, you can also turn the branches or the tree tops, which is very cool. So, if you put them up against each other, they do stand very well, as you can see in the corner. Uh-oh. Uh one of us, one of them, either I'm, oh, I am missing a leaf. I'm missing a leaf right here. So I can put that right back on like so. I'll click it right in. It is not broken. Clicks right in perfectly fine. Um, so very cool. Stands very well. So here we are. We get some, looks like a jaguars or cheetahs. I can't tell. So it's either a cheetah or it's definitely a jaguar maybe, cheetah. I don't know. Let me know in the comments section below. I could have swore. Cheaters are more like yellow, so let's see. Like this. You can tell the difference between the color patterns. So this has got to be either be a I think I don't know. I don't know how much I'm stumped on that one. Oh you get a bear. Oh I love the bear. You know that's so freaking cool. I love the coloration of that. So oh look at the size of this freaking rhino. Oh my gosh! I love the de Adventure Force nails it every time with these with these playsets. I love the detail, and obviously these these animals can go with your Animal Planet toys. I mean, of course you can mix them up. Uh, this is like a wild boar, wild hog. Very cool. Love it. Uh, here we have a baby rhino. Okay, this is a jaguar. It's got to be. That's definitely got to be a jaguar, right? I get confused between the two. I apologize, guys. Uh, next up, we have some elephants. Here's one elephant. And here's another elephant. Baby one and the... I don't know. That's like a male. I don't know. That, that's weird. How small it is. Oh, here's another rhino. Almost looks like a pig for a second, but it is a rhino. Oh, here we go. Another elephant. Look at the detail. I love these toys so much. They're, they, they're going to work wonders. Wonders. And the future for a, a safari animal movie. Wink, wink. Cough, cough. Little hint. Here's another male lion. Oh, my God. Look at the tiger. I love the tiger's mouth. That is so freaking awesome. Next up, we have another rhino. And a hippo. Very cool looking hippopotamus there. Okay, this is definitely looks like a bobcat. You guys can't tell me that does not look like a bobcat. That's got to be. It, it looks just like one. Here's a male lion, but with his mouth open. That's scary looking. That's very terrifying. I would not want to see that in the middle of the night. Uh, so we have some zebras. Very, like, hard plastic with these zebras. Very cool. It looks like a baby tiger. Very awesome. Next up, we have a baby giraffe. Can it stand? Yes, it can. I never had an issue with Animal or Adventure Force. 
their um, animal buckets or anything with standing. They, they always stand, the figures always stand very well. Oh, look, we have like a baby ape, baby gorilla. Very cool. That's very awesome. Another bobcat. A, another giraffe, baby giraffe. Some more. Oh, these are some like, oh, okay. So these are like smaller trees that you can put in the background that look like big trees, but they're in the background, so they look small. So background pieces, awesome. Next up, we have another uh, baby giraffe, a huge zebra, uh, another hippo, baby hippo, and oh, it looks like another, uh, oh, I know what kind of monkey this is. I. I don't know. Like, let me know how much it below. I f completely forgot what monkey this is. It's very cool, though. Oh, we got more in here. So you got a bunch of Dwayne Johnsons. A wrestling joke. The Rock. Get it? So we got a bunch of rocks in here. All different shapes and sizes. Very cool. And we have a another tiger and a, another male lion. That was just the 40-piece bucket, guys. Let's get to the jumbo one, the 55 pieces. Oh, I'm so excited for this one. I've never owned the 55-piece animal bucket before uh, with a, uh, the safari animal one. So let's go ahead and open up with this bad boy. Now, this one's got... Oh, there we go. I cracked the tape seal. Usually, you can just cut the tape, parents, but usually this seal comes right off. So, uh, here we go. You got a bunch of trees f right off the bat. I wonder how they pack this, like, a, in a facility, like a packing facility. I wonder how they, they you know, figure out what's going to get what. And... Well, that's unfortunate. This tree broke, but it's totally okay because it's not fully broken. And now I have, like, a, I can use this as, like, a plant on the ground that, you know, for them to eat, like a piece of grass or something. So that's very cool. So you get four trees. Good lord. Uh, five trees. I pretty much dang near have a whole forest. So let's go ahead and check this out. We, oh my goodness, holy crap. Okay, so we have a, a tiger, very small tiger. A hippopotamus with his mouth open. Very cool. That's scary. That is scary. Uh, another bobcat looking thing with his little mouth open. More bobcat. You're going to have a whole freaking, uh, whole pack of them. Here we go. We have two cheetahs. The, these are definitely cheetahs. Definitely cheetahs. You could tell by the coloration on the stomach and the side. Uh, okay. Look at the size of this giraffe. Oh my goodness, this thing is huge. Holy crap, oh, I love the, also I love the coloration as well. Got another little zebra there. Oh, this is the one I was looking forward to. This giant elephant. Look at the size. Obviously you get bigger pieces in the 55 uh, animal bucket, the jumbo bucket. Bigger animals, so love it. That is so cool. Oh, I can't wait to use these in an animation. That'd be so awesome. If you guys really want an animation, smack that like button. Let's see here. Next up, we have another another ape. He's scratching his head there. That's pretty cool. Another uh, giraffe. Different face scan this time. A gazelle. That's pretty awesome. Love the little horns. Stand. They all stand very well. I'm very impressed. Okay. We have another or a baby giraffe. We have another tiger. A baby elephant. Uh, another, oh, this is a brown, this is a dark grizzly bear. Brown bear, grizzly bear, whatever you want to call it. Another grizzly bear. Now imagine if you got a huge grizzly bear. That'd be so awesome. But you really got to look in the animal buckets before you buy them to kind of get, you know, to kind of know what you got. So, let's see here. Next up, we have, oh, look at this rhino. This rhino is so freaking awesome. Got another little monkey there. Got another hippo. Oh, there's so much stuff in here. You definitely get your money's worth with these toys, I'm telling you. Another zebra. Another, oh, a baby gorilla. 
tell about, you can tell by the way he's positioned. Another uh, elephant, a random rock. Oh, I crap! Oh, I dropped it. Oh, uh, here's another. Oh, uh, tiger, but with his mouth open like that, and he's like ready to, you know, bat an enemy or you know, bat his prey or whatever. A, a baby grizzly bear. Uh, next up, we have another baby elephant. Another male lion with his mouth open. Another baby elephant. Let's see what else we got here, guys. So we have another smaller elephant. Another baby hippo. Another rhino, rhinoceros. Another giraffe. A lot of giraffes, but totally okay. This one, you get a huge rock. Huge boulder. See what else we got. We're, we're coming to the last parts of the animal bucket, unfortunately, guys. So another baby rhino. Another cheetah. Another zebra. And another lion. Male lion. A lot of rocks. Whoa. So you get all those rocks. Oh, another baby rhino. Another hippo. And another zebra. And more rocks. That is it, guys. But a mix between the Adventure Force Safari Animals and the Animal Planet, uh, the Animal Planet Tubes, the Safari Animal Planet Tubes. This is a whole lot of fun for the kids and a lot of fun if you're an adult collector like me to do animations with. Very awesome, very good buy. You can, I found these at Target for like five bucks a piece. It's a lot of money, but. You know, when you live out in the middle of nowhere like I do, and you don't go to a Target a lot, you gotta you gotta just deal with it and pick it up. Plus, they don't really sell a lot of Animal Planet stuff in Walmart. They don't sell any Animal Planet stuff in Walmart, and uh, yeah, you got you just you gotta buy it when you can. Adventure Force Animal Buckets. You can obviously get a, your local Walmart. This one's like nine ninety nine or nine ninety seven, ten bucks. This one is like fourteen something. So. So definitely a great buy. I hope you guys enjoyed this toy review. I'm probably going to play with these off camera, to be honest with you. So smack the like button, subscribe to the notification bell, turn on, and you guys don't forget to stay awesome. See you guys later.